What up YouTube, this is LC. So I wanted to make this video because there seems to be a real lack of how-to videos uh, regarding Wikipedia. Uh, so in this video, you'll see me create an account, create a user page, use the sandbox, and make my first edit on the main page or to the actual encyclopedia. Basically, I'm going to do a few things that I think might intimidate or deter first-time editors. But why create an account in the first place? Well, there's a Wikipedia page for that. On the screen, you can see a bunch of reasons why creating a Wikipedia account is beneficial. But I think a few of the most important reasons are, one, you can create a user page, which I'll show you how to do in this video, and creating a user page allows you to personalize both the way you edit and the way you're seen on Wikipedia. You'll also have your own talk page, which makes communicating with editors easier. You'll have access to protected pages that people without accounts wouldn't be able to edit. And when you edit Wikipedia, your IP address will no longer be public. You can still edit Wikipedia without an account, but people will be able to see your IP address on the edits you make. So without further ado, let's start the video, and here's how to create an account. So from the main page, you're just going to click on Create Account and pick a username. I'm going to go with Leftist Commentary, just like my YouTube channel. And once you're done entering in your information, and you click create account you're going to click on your name that's red and create a user page go to create source and start editing you can just introduce yourself here so I'm gonna put hello I'm leftist commentary I'm excited to help edit Wikipedia you can put really anything you want but now you click preview preview lets you see what your edits going to do without publishing it and there are a ton of things that you can do to customize this and that would have to be its own video but just for an example uh, I'm gonna add three apostrophes and make leftist commentary bold uh, so preview and there you can see the changes. Uh, and now I publish it. So this is my user page. Uh, you can see my name has changed from red to blue. Um, if you want to learn more about how you can customize your user page, you can go to Wikipedia colon user page design center slash about you. Uh, it tells you, um, you know, what most people have on their Wikipedia profile um, and suggestions for what you can put uh, and also how to make it look cool. So for now, I just want to go to the sandbox and the sandbox is where you can kind of mess around and learn how to use Wikipedia for yourself without publishing to the main Wikipedia. And one of the first issues I had was uh, adding citations so I'm gonna try that in my sandbox uh, clicking on site and then templates so I say leftist commentary is an awesome YouTube channel and now I'm just going to enter in uh, google.com um, you know put in some fake information uh, but I want to make the title accurate LC Leftist commentary is awesome, here's why, so that way you can see um, what it would look like if it was an actual source. Click on that little calendar to get today's date, and then once again preview. And luckily I hit preview because I see there's something wrong in uh, the hyperlink. So I wasn't really sure why that was, I uh, knew something was wrong formatting, and I remembered that... Uh, you have to enter in the exact URL uh, for the hyperlink to come out correct. So I go and change that, and now you can see uh, the title, and then click Insert, and 
The reason I was always intimidated by citations is it kind of looks like code, um, but if I hit preview, I can see exactly how it will end up on the page. And now I'm going to add in a section uh, by adding in two equal signs on each side of the words I'm adding. I'm going to label it practicing editing citations. Um, once again, going to preview, and you can see the changes there with practicing editing citations as a sec new section or a section header. And then I'm going to make an edit summary. Uh, the edit summary is basically a note that tells other editors what I did on this particular edit. Um, so I'm going to put practicing adding citations uh, and then put uh, not real links um, just to make sure that you know it's not linked to my YouTube page or anything. Uh, do the security check real quick. Publish. And now my sandbox is complete. Uh, I can go in between my profile and sandbox and those are the two pages. I also have two notifications. Uh, my page has been reviewed, mark that as read, and then I made my first edit. So now I'm gonna make uh, my first edit to the actual encyclopedia on Wikipedia. So I went ahead and found a page where I could make an easy edit. It's corruption in the United States. And I noticed that I know of an organization that fights corruption or tries to pass legislation against corruption in the United States called Represent Us. And I think that would be a good addition to the See Also section. So I found the Wikipedia page for represent.us. Um, and I'm just going to copy the title exactly. So that way the hyperlink is correct. Now I'm going to go to edit the section uh, that I want to edit. Um, I can see that uh, just kind of intuitively that the asterisk is a bullet point um, and that it's in alphabetical order. So I'm just going to go ahead and add represent.us uh, into the correct place. Uh, in the see also section. I'm going to put two brackets around it and that's going to create a Wikipedia hyperlink that will go directly to this page. While I was on the represent.us page I noticed the American Anti-Corruption Act. That also seems like it would be a good addition to the see also section of the uh, corruption in the United States page. Of course, I then forgot uh, the alphabetical order rule, but once again, add in two brackets on each side of the title, and that'll create a Wikipedia hyperlink. Write up a quick edit summary, uh, added represent.us and the American Anti-Corruption Act, uh, hit preview, make sure everything looks good. Um, and then I can also, uh, I can even hyperlink the pages in the edit summary. So I'm going to add two brackets around represent.us and the American Anti-Corruption Act. And then when I preview, you can see that in the actual edit summary, it will link to those Wikipedia pages. Uh, I'm going to watch the page. I'll explain that later. Publish. And now I can see uh, my two editions on the corruption in the United States Wikipedia page. I can also access the history of the Wikipedia page by clicking View History. There I can see all the past edits. Uh, so there's me, leftist commentary, the time, and the edit summary. You can also see the previous versions with those edits. Um, 
but I can also see my individual contributions, so all the edits that I've ever made. If I click on contributions, I can see all the edits I've made to Wikipedia thus far. The edit to my user page, the edit to my sandbox, and my most recent edit to corruption in the United States along with the edit summary. I can also see the change from each one of my specific edits by clicking on the diff. Here I can see I added represent.us and the American Anti-Corruption Act to the corruption in the United States page. If I go back one edit, I can see what that editor did and they changed the wording uh, of the intro. And I can also see that the additions I made are not there on this older version. So that's just a quick intro into how to navigate Wikipedia and how to make your own uh, Wikipedia page. Um, I have some new ideas through uh, some suggestions on Reddit, but if you have any other suggestions, uh, leave them down in the comments and uh, I'll see if I can make a video on it. Uh, thanks for watching.